Hi, I'm Jesse Garrison. Welcome to Canon's EOS 101 series. This is where we're going to help you understand the basic concepts of photography to help you take a good photo. Let's say you want to take a photo in the city and capture the action of fast-moving traffic, or take a portrait shot and get that beautiful, blurry background. How do you accomplish shots like these? Well, there are a number of creative options, and knowing how to use your camera to get that photo is part of what we'll cover on the shutter, on aperture, and ISO. You'll discover how each works as an individual camera component, and how they function together as an inseparable and amazingly adjustable system. We'll investigate how EOS cameras can further assist your development in photography by explaining the options you have with automatic exposure, such as in portrait mode, sports mode, and others. And as you advance in your photography, you'll see how to use features like the various autofocus and exposure modes. You'll learn that flash photography is not just for nighttime. Discover how flash can be used for balanced, natural-looking pictures day or night. Once you take your photo, you'll have to decide how you want to use it or where you want to place it. On a social networking website, maybe you want to print one out. And then for safekeeping, store it on a hard drive connected to your computer. The tools you'll discover not only apply to still photos, but to the moving image. So we'll take a peek into the world of video with your EOS camera. This is part of what we'll examine in the tutorials. We'll show you how to make an informed choice on the type, size, and quality of your image files. All of these concepts and the camera features that work together are important for empowering yourself as a photographer. It's from this understanding that you'll begin to see where great images come from. Thanks for joining us for this video series. We hope you enjoy it.